There's a prize every time. Okay. Or is it Mystic Morgan today? Yes, yes. That could be at all. He'd have Do you food. see anything in the crystal ball? Yes. Closer, closer. Oh, shall I take a seat? There, there. What am I looking Do at? Do you see anything in the crystal ball? The mists are clearing. What do you see? Deeper, deeper, through the fog, through the mists. Now I can see. Can you see my future? I see. I see great things ahead. Will I ever leave Sexton alive? <laughs> Why do you think yes. you're gonna die? Yes. You will live uh, long and have many adventures. Oh, joy. Tell me, will I find the lost crown? That which is lost may not be found. But I will. No. I will find it. It shall not be. I feel like I'm being followed or haunted. Do you? Closer. Closer. What? Are they closer to me? Deeper, deeper, through the fog, through the mists. Are they coming for me? Yes, yes. What can I do? What can I do? That which is lost may not be found. Are you saying that I should leave the crown? Yes. I'll cross your palm with silver again, soon. I see. I see great things ahead. Oh, that was oddly not interesting. <laughs> the Mayday Raffle has now been drawn. The winning ticket is one, four, two. Congratulations to the winner. Yay, we won, apparently, because there's nobody else here except that little kid, and I'm really confused by that. Maybe nobody else lives here in this town. You've done it. Come. Come and collect your prize. But how? You must have sold hundreds of tickets. To who? Uh, well, a few tickets, maybe. But, but why quibble? You've won. Perhaps it will help with my mission. You've given me new hope, Nigel. I believe there's a great treasure out there across the fens. Seek the truth and prove to me that I was mistaken. Gamble's crown, should it exist, could take pride of place in our humble museum. Have a good day, <sighs> Professor. You too, my boy. You too. Wonderful. It's come together beautifully. <clears throat> Time for me to go. Be careful, Nigel. Remember your reading. Not all is as it seems. Yeah, fine. 
Bob, how about a telescope? We still haven't given me. Happy May Day, Mr. Tawny. Bob, please. And yes, it's a fine May Day. Did you fix that old telescope? I did. First thing this morning. Here you go. Looks a bit familiar. Yeah, <laughs> shit. I'll let you enjoy May Day. Yeah, you too, lad. Go find her. Okay, so you got to watch. We <sighs> figure out the symbol, I guess. I've seen this picture. Count corner in the box. Uh. Be sure to try Bob Tawny's delicious fat. Where this whole town is deserted? This way? No, not that way. And that way. Apparently, I'm allowed to in here. Okay, this way then. I want to have lunch. Good afternoon, Reese. I'm oh, sorry about Mr. Tibbs. If I get my hands on who did that, by the Celtic gods, I'll crush them. It's a police matter now. Oh, Mr. Tibbs. Well, what can I do for you? Do you have anything on ancient symbolism or uh, pictograms? Sure, boy. You check the bookshelf. I'm researching local legends and mysteries. Hmm, right you are. Any more tips on photography? Ah, still snapping, eh? Trying to. The photos are none too great. Just try your best. Trust your own eyes. Did you know Alex Spitmore was an imposter? Keep in mind that I see a lot of Saxton, day by day. The arrival of a young man in Sexton would not escape me. See you around, Reese. I certainly hope so. Oh, Mr. T. Health and vitality. That's not right. This pictogram signifies the Great Fen. This pictogram signifies the Great Fen. Is it all the same? This pictogram yeah. signifies the Great Fen. The Great Fen, yeah, okay. That didn't help at all! Welcome church. I found you at last. What we were looking for it now? What? Oh my god.
There we go. A memorial with a eulogy. Oh, can't, you can't read it. Oh god, another church. A church built onto the cliff tops overlooking the sea. There's an impressive clock on the tower. Mister, I thought you were my brother, Timmy. We're playing hide and seek. Wanna join in? Hello, who might you be? My name, Nancy. Nancy Brewer. My brother, if we can find him, is Timmy. His real name's Thomas. But don't tell him I told you that. He hates it. Isn't this the same voice actor as Lucy? <laughs> uh... Why does Timmy hate his name? It's my dad's fault, you see. His father's name was Thomas. So it runs in the family, if you like. Where is Timmy? Do you want to look for him? Oh, mister, that would save me the trouble. And I can sit here listening to me records. Is the gramophone yours? We found it back there, in the vestry, hidden under some old boxes. And right next to it, a box of dusty old records. Choose your bit old fashioned, but it's better than sitting in silence, don't you think? Can I ask you about the church? Yeah, of course. Go ahead. I've nothing better to do. I'm a lady of leisure. Does the vicar mind you being in the church? The vicar? We don't see many people here. I'm surprised to see you. We hear things sometimes. Footsteps and coughs. There's no one there. Timmy thinks it's ghosts. But I told him there's no such thing. He's a funny one. Have you seen that stone tablet in the churchyard? Yeah, I've seen that old stone. It's like a gravestone, but there's no one dead underneath it. That's right. There's writing on it. I can't read it. It's gibberish. Timmy thinks it's a riddle. Maybe you can help him solve it. <laughs> What are you doing in the church? Just playing. It's cool in here, away from the sunlight. Too much bright sun doesn't agree with me. What do you mean? Bad for a complexion, like mine. That's what the doctor says anyway. It's nice in here. I've never been in many churches back home. But this one's nice. It's quiet and cool. Have you been in the tower? Yeah, of course. Seems like ages ago now. Timmy found a key. Big old key it was. Rusty too. I don't think many people go up the tower. No, I don't suppose they do. 